Okay, so today I just want to show you real quick an easy way to animate your characters um, and import them into Maya. So basically what this means is uh, you know you can export your character from Maya and use the website which I'm going to show you in a second and animate your character and then bring that back into Maya. So this is one of the uh, one of the animations that I exported from that website that I'm going to show you in a second here. Uh, as you can see, you know, it looks pretty good. So just an idle animation for my character here, my Luigi character. Um, in my opinion, it looks pretty good. And I'll show you how I got this animation done uh, automatically in a different website. So, so this is the website that I used for this. And that you can use as well. Uh, it's uh, called Mixamo. Uh, it's owned by Adobe. And basically, all you have to do is sign up. Uh, it's free to sign up, um, and it's also free to download the animations as well that you create. So let me just show you how I did this. So what I did was I went to my original uh, character rig, and it doesn't have to be rigged, by the way. By the way. I selected my character, I'm going to, well, in my case, I'm just going to duplicate this guy. And I'll probably delete everything else. And what I'll do is I'll do a file export selection and then export it as an OBJ. Just give it a name and just and then just uh, export that. And then once you're done with that, you can come in here in the Mixamo website. And then under the animations tab. What you do is you click on upload character. So I'm going to do that to show you, you know, from the beginning. And it shows here, you know, uh, there's some instructions if you want to follow on how to prepare your character for this. But basically my character, and if you've been following my rigging tutorial, your character's already set up. So select your character and upload it. And it just takes a few seconds. And then once that's done, you'll see your character. And by the way, if you see an error, so I was getting an error earlier when I was trying to import as an FBX. Uh, for some reason it just wouldn't import. And I'm not really sure what uh, what that was all about. But when I export as an OBJ, it works perfectly fine. I was also not able to import it with a texture. Um, I was following their, their instructions, but it still didn't work. So I'm not sure you know, if anyone out there knows how to make that work. You know, please share that in the comments. But anyway, once you import your model, just click on next. Basically, it prompts you to, you know, place markers. So for the chin, just place it on the chin. And then the wrist. About there, and then elbows. So what you're doing here, basically, is... Uh, the website's basically going to auto rig your character, so they're going to do the rigging for you. And they have different options here for fingers and you know different things. But let's click on next. And now, right now, what it's doing is rigging that character, so they're applying all the joints uh, and probably controls as well. And once you're done, you'll see that you know your character moving and everything. So I think this is pretty sweet. What you'll notice is that their rigging is really good. As you can see, I'm zooming into the fingers here. Their fingers have been rigged really well. I'm actually surprised on that. Um, you can even enable the uh, rig. So this is what the joints look like, as you can see. And it's really, if you were following my rigging tutorial, it's really similar to what we did. Uh, you know, all the pieces here. So as you can see now, we have our character, you can click next and then you'll see it here in this window and then, so basically what they do is they auto rig your character and they also give you a lot of uh, animations here to choose from that you can just download for free basically and then import those into Maya. So as you can see they have quite the number of animations basically that you can use and what I'm thinking this is useful for, I don't know how useful this is for, say, a game or a film, but I think what this is useful for is for learning. So you can use 
their animations, import them into Maya and use them as references when you're animating yourself. So I think that's what this is useful for. But yeah, they, they have some pretty funny animations here. Um, so you can just go through all of them. They have quite, quite a number of animations. So yeah, so okay, so once you're done with the animation that you want, and you're gonna have to download each if you're uh, depending on which animation you want. So let's say we want this guy, so we can do is download it. You can choose the format. I'll choose FBX uh, frames. I guess 30 is fine. With the skin, yes, and then just download that. So basically, you can download it for free. And again, you can download as many as you want. I'm not sure what their um, licensing is, if they allow you to use these for games or film. I'm not sure on that, so you're going to have to you know, look it up. But anyway, so let's go back to Maya now. Let me make a new file here. Don't save it. And I'm just going to import that. And here we go. And then we can just play it in Maya. And as we can see now, our animation came through and uh, so yeah I think it's pretty nice they their rigging is actually pretty good I'm actually impressed at how good it is um, so yeah and, and it's really similar to what we did in our rigging tutorial so again what I think this is useful for is uh, just for animating your if you're a character artist and you just want to show your characters animated maybe in your portfolio or something or online I think this is a pretty good way of doing that and then just rendering it uh, either in Maya or Marmoset Toolback. Or if you are an animator or learning animation, you, what you can do with this is uh, download the animations and you just use them as references. So just purely reference and then just try to copy what, the, uh, what these animations are, right? So yeah, basically this is this is just what I wanted to show you. I, I just found this website. I found it a few years back, but I just wanted to go back to it and see how they were doing. And it, it's a lot better than what it was back then. I just thought it would, be, it would be really cool to show you guys about this website. So anyway, if you liked the video, uh, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. Also, don't forget to check out our link below for our official channel merchandise. We have some nice t-shirt designs and we ship worldwide. Uh, yeah, don't forget to check that out and leave your comments below. Thank you.